lean versus six sigma healthcare executives are increasingly turning to lean and six sigma to achieve rapid results in process improvement lean's focus is to reduce waste and improve cycle time while six sigma focuses on reducing variation and eliminating error Reported results from Lean and Six Sigma projects are significant in reducing footsteps, shortening wait times, reducing inventory, increasing standardization, improving patient and staff satisfaction, and lowering cost. While Lean and Six Sigma were developed separately, they have similar goals and approaches. The approaches complement each other. Comparison between Lean and Six Sigma reveals that Lean is a philosophy of identifying and eliminating non-essential and non-value-adding activities to streamline production and thereby improve quality. Whereas Six Sigma is a change management methodology to manage, improve, and or reinvent business processes to limit process variations to 3.4 defects per million opportunities and thereby improve quality the fundamental difference between lean and six sigma is that lean is a philosophy and six sigma is a program lean attempts to inculcate an organizational culture change and permanent behavior change among employees to identify and eliminate waste whereas six sigma is a methodological process intervention that does not attempt to change the organizational culture or attempt a permanent behavioral change among employees lean identifies the need for a process or activity first and if the activity adds value tries to improve on such activity through improved process flow and enhancing productivity six sigma focuses specifically on eliminating process variations in output without looking into the merits of such processes in the scheme of things lean as the name suggests breaks down processes to bare bone essentials under its guiding principle that any activity or function that does not add value constitutes waste that needs elimination six sigma on the other hand does not question whether the activity or function adds value and works under the guiding principle that any variation in existing process or output is waste Lean is continuous and ongoing approach under the assumption that the day-to-day -day changes in technology, external environment and other factors always leave room for improvement. Six Sigma on the other hand is a project-based approach and the Six Sigma project group disbands on achieving the set change objectives, leaving metrics or control charts to prevent rollback. A major difference between Lean and Six Sigma pertains to the ownership of the concepts. Lean aims at continuous improvement across the entire value stream of operations by encouraging and empowering the entire workforce to identify and eliminate waste in their sphere of activity. It is an ongoing process ingrained to operations of the firm and requires adoption by the entire workforce and in all aspects of the company operations for effectiveness. Six Sigma, on the other hand, is a methodical approach that aims to eliminate variations in a specific project or area of operations and the results remain confined to such specific area instead of permitting to the entire organization. The onus on implementation of Six Sigma falls on special purpose teams such as inventory reduction team, manufacturing scrap reduction team and others formed specifically for the purpose. Summary Lean thinking emphasizes on minimizing waste and 
maximizing customer satisfaction. The seven categories of waste are confusion, defects, overprocessing, over inventory, overproduction, baiting and excessive motion of patients and staff. Lean is implemented through a set of practical techniques like BSM and 5S. Both approaches aim to achieve the same goal, to improve quality and lower cost at the same time. However, there is a different logic behind each approach. Most of the lean concepts were being practiced as early as 1910 by Henry Ford. Post-World War II, Japanese leaders such as Toyota Motor Company's E.G. Toyoda, Taichi Ono, and Shingyo Shingo developed a process-focused production system now known as the Toyota Production System or Lean Production. The objective of this system was to eliminate or reduce non-value added tasks and to minimize the consumption of resources that added no value to product. These concepts and techniques were reintroduced and popularized in America under the umbrella of lean manufacturing. Lean in healthcare Principles of lean management work in healthcare is as much the same way as they do in other industries. Lean thinking identifies the least wasteful way to provide better and safer healthcare to patients without any delays. Adapted to healthcare, Waste is anything other than the minimum amount of supplies, equipment, personnel, space, and time that is absolutely essential to deliver a quality level of clinically accepted patient treatment. Adoption of lean management strategies can help healthcare organizations to improve processes and outcomes, reduce cost, increase satisfaction among patients, providers, and staff. Seven categories of waste with examples are Number one, confusion, that is, same activity being performed differently by different people, unclear doctor's orders, unclear route for medicine administration. Number two, defects, that is, medication errors, surgical errors, incorrect charges or billing. Number three, overprocessing that is, clarifying orders and redundant data collection or charting. Number four, over inventory, that is, overstocked medication on units, overstocked supplies on units and in warehouses, out of date or expired medications. Number five, overproduction, that is, duplicate charting, multiple forms with same information, Copies of reports sent automatically. Number six, waiting. That is, patients waiting for appointments and procedures, waiting for other workers at meetings, surgeries, and procedures. Number seven, excessive motion of patients and staff. That is, looking for information, materials, and people. And poor layout of the hospital. For example, PAT lab located far away from ED. Lean is implemented through the use of a set of practical tools and techniques. Out of these, value strip mapping and 5S are often used for improving healthcare processes. Value stream mapping is used to diagram and document the patient flow, information flow or flow of supplies in order to see where value is being added and where waste is occurring. Through such value stream maps, analysts can determine how many process steps could be reduced and whether the time for some of the process steps could be reduced. 5S tool includes number 1. Sort, that is, organization. In this, it separates what is needed from what is not needed. It keeps only what is needed in appropriate amount and only when it is needed. And it removes unnecessary items. Number two, set in order, that is, orderliness. In this, items are arranged in such a way that they are easy to find and use. It labels the items and storage sites. And it implements visual control. Number three, sweep and shine, that is, cleanliness. It removes dirt, 
mess, clutter and dust from the workplace and it keeps everything clean and tidy. Number 4. Standardize. In this, organization, orderliness and cleanliness incorporated as habit and it operates according to standard operating procedures. Number 5. Sustain. It includes making a habit of maintaining correct procedures and continuously improves workplace keywords. Lean. Lean means creating more value for customers with fewer resources. Waste. Waste is the use of any material or resource beyond what the customer requires and is willing to pay for. 5S. 5S is the name of a workplace organization method describe how to organize a workspace for efficiency and effectiveness by identifying and storing the items used, maintaining the area and items, and sustaining the new order. Total Productive Maintenance Total Productive Maintenance TPM, is a system of maintaining and improving the integrity of production and quality systems through the machines, equipment, processes, and employees that add business value to an organization. Toyota Production System TPS, the Toyota Production System TPS, is an integrated socio-technical system, developed by Toyota that comprises its management philosophy and practices. Further readings. Mm -hmm.